Hi, Nikki. Thanks for the update. Uh, okay, I'm just going to run you through what we need to do here. I mean, you can even do this from your end, um, but I'll show you how to get going. And if you want help, I'll give you some information to send to me. Uh, first thing we need to do is go to the license information, the little blue button. And we just need to pop in your domain right here. So basically hit the proceed button to start with. Type in your domain right here and then hit proceed again. Okay, that's going to give us a, an access point to the, um, when installing the Numo system to the server. It just needs to know what domain it's coming from. Okay, so once that's done, um, once you've put the domain in there, what we need to do is um, after that point, we just go to say, the instructions tab and we're going to click the web apps. And right here, there's the blog, there's the view instructions. We're just going to hit install Numo. All right, and then we'll select, you see the, um, your domain name will then show up. And it's going to ask for uh, data, some database information and your FTP information. And then there's going to be a button to install, like just go ahead and install everything. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to send you a little snippet of uh, information. I just want to make sure you're not hosted with us first. Hang on a sec. No, okay, if you're a host with us, I can do it um, automatically from my end. But I'm going to give you a little snippet of information that you can send to your web host. Just send a customer support ticket to your web host or uh, a contact ticket and ask them to create a database for your account. And if they could just fill in the following, you know, the database name and address. And I'm going to send you all the information that they, they would need and that we would need back. And then we can just go ahead and populate the fields um with that information hit install and it'll be installed automatically to your server so anyways that's where we get started with so the first thing we need to do is right here in your account under license information the blue button is go there and actually hit the proceed button and then put in your domain name and then hit proceed again so that tells the system where the uh blog is going to be installed to and then once we've done that we can go and uh, actually uh, physically install it to your server uh, but we just need a little bit of information filled out and uh, in the ticket there'll be a little blurb of information that you can copy and paste to your web host and uh, then just send the information back to me if you want and we'll get that installed for you.